Deputy ambush and kill while on his way to work. Let's get into it. Afternoon at an intersection in West Houston. Police say the suspect got out of his car, walked up to the car Meyer Husseini was in, and fired several times. Late this afternoon, the suspect was caught after crashing his car in Galveston and attempting to swim to escape. Fox Wars David Centendry is in the newsroom with the latest. David. Well, the name of the accused killer has not been released by police, but it's being called an ambush murder. Video shows a man treading water after he drove his car into the water near the old Galveston Causeway while leading law enforcement officers on a pursuit after he allegedly shot and killed a Harris County constable deputy at a Houston intersection Tuesday afternoon. And then they're coming out with ARs and everything. I'm like, oh, shoot. Allison Godwin witnessed the end of the pursuit and the suspect attempting to swim away before he was captured. Tuesday night, video shows him being taken into custody on a stretcher and loaded into an ambulance. His gray Chevy Impala was pulled out of the water. Swimming further and further out, but that's a tough swim to Texas City and he wasn't gonna make it. By the time they got the boat out there, he was probably exhausted. The deputy he's accused of killing was Maher Husseini, who was driving to work in his personal vehicle and not in uniform, according to the Houston Police Department. I will share with you that he was shot in his car at the intersection. Police say the shooter got out of his car at an intersection in West Houston and fired several shots into Husseini's SUV. A motive is unclear, but investigators are working to determine if Husseini was targeted or if maybe it was an act of road rage. I mean, there's total chaos in our communities and we got to get it fixed. Harris County Precinct 4 Constable Mark Herman says Husseini, who's been with his office since 2021, was recently promoted. He leaves behind a wife and two kids. But there's too many of these. I mean, we're seeing too many of these and we'll bring this person to justice quickly because he was on his way to work when he got shot. This man was just on his way to work to protect and serve and somebody just randomly targeted him and decided to kill him. And he wasn't even in his uniform, so it's not even like they was target him because he's an officer, unless the person has some type of personal vendetta against him and decided to track him and follow him to this point and kill him, which the officers, they're not stating that's the point. I'm guessing they didn't see any surveillance camera with car tailing or following the deputy. But my condolences to the deputy's family and let me know what you guys think.